Bum bum bum. So apparently I forgot to finish a job last night. Wah wah. I'm really terrible at this whole finishing jobs thing. Well, you guys at least are learning what not to do. And it's certainly that. So, how has everybody been? I've been pretty good. I'm eager to start getting this game going. Definitely in the beginning of Harvest Moon games, I find it's uh, a little bit long to get started. But then once you, you know, start get upgrading the tools and doing all the things, you end up just just uh, progressing in the game quite a lot faster. So I've been seeing that there's lots and lots of people uploading videos for Story of Scenes and Trio of Towns now. When I first thought to do this. Um, there wasn't quite as many people uh, taking on this game, so I do hope that everybody who's watching is still enjoying. I know when I really like a game, I watch every single playthrough I can get my hands on. Uh, and, you know, YouTube and it Infinite Wonder. So, I, and I really appreciate the support of the people who have been commenting and, and liking and subscribing. So, da 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 da! I know everybody probably uh, who watches me is like, where's my Pokemon content? And guys, guys, I I just, it's so hard to, uh, to have a chance to do anything when it comes to uh, uh, recording live. And, and, and that's, that's, that's the reason. Yep. yep. Like, hi, Clark. We got my egg. Let's bring you out. So, of course, every day I always kind of start the same way. Um, and I check on my animal. And I'm going to give him a treat. And he looks happy. And I get my egg. And we have not bought a cow yet. But I think that we should. Uh, even though I was saying we don't have a lot of, a lot of stamina, I still want to do things in the game. So that would be a reason. Remember in the beginning of the game, you want to like click on as many bugs as you can. And you want to remember that items, items, items. So we've got all these animals. Hi, animals. Eventually you shall love me. One thing about this game that we do have is familiars. I find them very fur, fur endly. Huh. See what I did there? See what I did there? Oh snap! We're in t we're in the the way to town. We're in south, southwestern, south. I can't even remember if it's south or north. So we're gonna press our little uh, L button and talk to all the people without really talking to all the people. And we can definitely remember that it is, I believe, it's Hector's birthday today. It's somebody's birthday today. Um, I'm not sure whose birthday. Oh, goodness. I can't remember. We'll definitely have to go back to the house and check whose birthday it is. Uh, da, 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 da. Remembering people's names is hard. If you actually are having a hard time remembering people's names, you can actually touch the little question mark on the bottom of your screen and their names will pop up on the town map. That is something that I did not realize until very late into the game. Uh, and it, it definitely um, helped in remembering the names of all the characters. So we're going to go through. We're going to pick up all of our stuff here. Oh, hi, little bear. Hello, little Blair. Be he hello, Blair Bear. Ha, Blair Bear. La di da di da. Ooh, Ford's arriving. This is another love interest. Howdy, Panko. <gasps> Gasp. Do, 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 do. Hi. Ooh, I love it when you say hi to me. Come to run some errands? Oh yeah, I did. You know what? What's up? Me? I'm on my way to see a friend of mine. You know what? Why don't you tag along too and I'll introduce you. Huh? Alright. You heard about how the doc from the clinic was off on business, right? Well, he finally came home just the other day. If you're ever feeling out of sorts, he's the one who'll check you back on your feet. I reckon it's worth it while to go say hello. Yay. Alrighty then, this is the way, Panko. Oh, wait. What? Pardon me, could you hold still for a sec? <gasps> is he gonna, is he gonna kiss me? Or come on to me? What, what, what could he possibly be doing? It's really stressing me out, Wayne. 
Hmm, not too dirty. I guess it'll have to do. <gasps> uh, well, I don't want to own a shower, so... Uh, the dock can be kind of finicky about cleanliness and lack. Don't worry about it. Come on. Oh, this is Ford. One of my friends actually married Ford. Yep. Yep. He's apparently just as annoying as a husband. <gasps> Ford, you in? Hmm, Wayne, is that you? I'm in the middle of brainstorming right now. I am not to be disturbed unless there's a patient who requires my immediate attention. Wait, uh, quietly, over there, and I will get you later. Oh. Arr. Sorry, when he, uh, he gets this way sometimes. How about we have a seat over on the sofa and wait? Uh, Alright, like, I was, I mean, I was planning on doing things today. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah. Ah! <gasps> Gasp! Da, da, da. Now then, what is? No, wait. Now then, what is it? Wow, that was faster than I expected. I heard a voice other than yours, and I could hardly concentrate with you two nattering over there. Blah blah blah. I mean, I'm Pango. Hmm. Well, isn't that a proper greeting? Bom 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 bom. My name is Ford, and I'm the doctor of this establishment. Ford's birthday is winter, too. His wrapping paper is simple paper, plain cloth, and a simple box. His special gift is, so is pin pinso soup, which is soybean, carrot, potato, onion, flour, and the recipe is for sale at the Garden Grill once uh, Weston is A rank. But his loved gift, don't worry, are all herbs, so aloe, chamomile, and thyme, etc. You can also give him carrots, green peppers, spinach, banana, mixed salad, summer veggie salad, vegetable O2, pot au feu, coffee, and grass drink. He also likes ginger flower foods, mugwort, giant butterbur, and crops such as turnip, pumpkin, onion, Bird, uh, burdock roots, sweet potatoes. He likes eggs and ye uh, yogurt and yellow cloth and carrot soup and everything. Oh my goodness. But don't you give him any Yukon or else you'll get one, a minus 1,000 friend points. He, he's a he's very easy one to woo. <laughs> so, you're Frank's niece, hmm? You look a little perfectly... You look like a perfectly healthy young woman, so I presume you're not here for my services. Uh, thanks? Pa uh, yes, passable for now, I suppose. But allow me to make one thing clear. I have no patience for slob or rough, uh, rough, rough ragamuffins. Slobs or ragamuffins. I almost said rough muffins. <laughs> if you should wish to see me, come and clean yourself and be properly attired. All right. Now, is that all? Yeah, I guess that's it. I see. Well, then off with you both. Dismissed. Uh, uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, yeah, like I said, he can be kind of weird like that. He's a good guy, though, honest. If he didn't scare you off, uh, too bad. Go on and visit him again sometime. I will. I will definitely visit for it again. He's not that bad of a guy. He's just a little... He's just a little bit Ford. Let's, let's just say that. He's just a little bit Ford. So I think it's high time. Oh, cuz well, no, it's it's 9:30. That's not high time. No. Oh, uh we get scolded for not doing our part-time job properly. So let's uh do postal carrier. Uh we don't have any milk. And we, so we can chop woods. First we're going to go get our postal carrier from the postal service cuz you know, the postman can't do that and the events the little cutscenes do not count as talking to the person so do make sure that you go and talk to Ford because you want to make sure you're building those friend points and talking to people every single day so that they like you la 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 and when we go check the book at the end of the day you would see that you hadn't talked to him if you had thought that you talked to him because of the cutscene when you didn't talk to him because of the cutscene got it clear yeah huh hmm <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna take Lizette's cutting job, woodcutter. I love the wood cutting jobs. These jobs are really nice at the beginning of the game. You know, you wanna get money and you wanna get friendship points and doing things for the town is one way to do that. And all you have to do is fop, fop five pieces of wood. Yeah, I said fop. I am not on the ball with my words today. Ha, gosh, Jim G. Wilkers. 
la, 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 we chopped the wood. Uh, yes, I think that does it. Please accept this for all your hard work. A hundred and sixty gold. If you could spare the time, I could always use more help. See you later. Why do I think she's always, always, like, just the happiest person? I just, I just, that's what I think she is. Hey, Carrie. Hey, Carrie. Oh, come on, Lizette. La-dee-da-dee-da. -da. Lizette, here you go. This is the package for you. Two jobs successfully completed today. Yay. Yay for Banco. Now I just have to remember whoever's birthday it was. Woo. Okay. So I am going to show you uh, things that you can get to romance people. Uh, just because we do want to get their, their friendship points up fairly high to make sure that we have romanced everyone we can possibly romance. You know, romancing people. Romancing people super fun. Marco was chatting with Charlie over there. Charlie's not a main character though, so I don't really care about him. Do 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 Jumpy, jumpy. I'm just going to check what Miranda's selling. I realized I should check if she has any after I told you guys to buy things people like. She does not have any coffee yet, but when she does, peoples... You know, we should grab a pocket calendar so then I don't have to keep running back home to uh, check things like what's on the agenda for today. Pocket calendars are pretty useful. I ended up selling mine in my in the other game because I didn't find it that useful. But we can go ahead and register that so it's easy to get to and let's check it. And it is Hector's birthday. See, I knew it was Hector's birthday. I had a thought that it was Hector's birthday. What do you think Hector would like? Hmm, I think we're just going to give him like a rock or something. Find a nice rock for Hector. Oh, look, there's a nice rock. <laughs> oh, hi, Noel. Just in case I didn't talk to you. I'm pretty sure I did talk to you. And is anybody selling anything interesting? Oh my gosh, I want animals. I want animals. I want, like, a, I want a familiar right now. And oh, and I'll have to get you guys to pick my cow. You definitely need to pick my cow. I, I don't know what kind of cow I want. Buy items. We just want to check every time. Do we have an... Uh, we, I think we have everything here. I don't think... Yeah, because it's the hammer that we're missing. I'm just remembering everything we need. Shopping at the stores. Talking to everyone. Natasha, what was you like? Uh, no, I don't need an cinnamon or Walmart. Oh, Walmart. I don't need any Walmart, guys. Not a single Walmart. So remember how I said you do want to talk to everybody. So let's go take a shout at Ford and you know there's somebody waiting for Ford and I think he's like eating upstairs da, da, da. yeah he is ah, I called it no I do not require your assistance for anything I just wanted to make sure that I talked to you because you know I've been here in town and I'm new and I'm hopping hopping all right let's go give Hector a rock I think that's what we decided right team go team all right, let's go give him a rock. Let's go give him a rock. Ooh, I got distracted. Let's go give him a rock. Okay. Uh, and why rock? Because I feel like Hector wouldn't like many things. Let's give him a pebble. We don't, we'll just, it's because it's his birthday. You got me a birthday present? Thanks. Yes. That was, that was your birthday present. <laughs> I, I picked it off the street yourself, myself. I just didn't know what else to give him. You guys can comment below and tell me if you think that giving him a rock was the best thing I could have possibly given him. I'd be interested to know, guys. Very, very interested to know. La -de -da -de -da. All right, so we, we have our stuff here. So I think I'm just going to take a moment to use our stamina to get down this broadleaf. And then we're going to go eat at the restaurant because... Spending money in the town definitely increases all of the things that we want to increase, all the all the friendship points and everything to do with the town itself. So you want to make sure that you continue to increase uh, friendships and and whatnot. Oh no, I accidentally chopped it all into small lumber. La -de -da -de -da 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 -da. Okay, let's go ahead and. Put, uh, we're going to place all 16 of these twigs. And I'll show you something magical. Bam! All 16 are cut. So that's the way you do that. I feel like I need to like put my hands together. Like, you know how you go like, chut, 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 chut. Like, 
The way you the way you do the hands thing. You guys know what I mean. You get it. You get what I'm saying. Oh, woohoo! We might need to meet Ford again if I'm not careful. All right, I'll see you guys back at the wee food place. All right, we made it back to the restaurant, and he's open. Welcome to the Garden Grill. Let's order some food on this fine day. Ooh, we've got a lot of fancy food here. Hmm. Now I really like that chef special, but let's try out quiche. <laughs> that is Lizette's favorite, and it has this like huge inside joke between Mr. Panko and I because he married Lizette. So, ooh, meal at the restaurant. Nom nom nom. Mmm. And you know you can uh, definitely dine with people too if you get the friendship high enough. So these are the reasons. These are the reasons, folks. These are the the reason reasons why we're working so hard. So I think that's everything that we have to do other than cutting down some stuff and putting our chicken away. So I will meet you back at the farm, and we're gonna put our little chicken away. Chicken, come here, my little chicken. Book book. And we're going to make sure, is your food okay? We're going to add one more food. Make sure he's all good and stocked up. I don't think there's anything else we can really do with the chicken. Chickens are pretty easy to take care of. Uh, let's go ahead and axe this softwood. La -dee -da 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 -da. I was going to suggest doing the boulder, but again, I do not have a hammer yet. Because if I had a hammer, I'd be mining. But not every day, because if you mine every couple of days, you actually get better items. And uh, that is something, again, I did not know until I was pretty far into the game, well into year two. So, speaking about the game, I need to actually play my copy of it. So, Mr. Pango got way ahead of me. Yep, he's, uh, he's way into marriage and almost has kids in the game. I'm not sure if I want kids in the game. I've got them in real life. Ah! <laughs> yeah, I <you> know. <laughs> so, Lee, we've got the softwood. We are chopping. Good job, Pineco. All right, let's go put all of our items away. We're not going to push Pineco any further today. Blah, blah, blah. Thank you, everyone, for watching this next episode of Story of Seasons Trio of Towns. I will see you guys in the next episode, and I hope all of your crops are golden.